call me? I didn't call you anything. You okay. started me off. I appreciate that, Mike. I love you. Today, we're discussing some recent news in boxing. The second face-off between Mike Tyson and Jake Paul is happening during their press tour at the AT&T Stadium, where their fight will take place. This press tour heated up due to the intense trash talk between the two and the questions from fans. Some people speculated that their fight was scripted, believing that even if it were, Tyson would still knock out Jake Paul. Tyson's fans are eager to witness this, regardless of the script. And Tyson himself is keen on delivering. Tell these people who keep saying that this fight is scripted for Jake Paul to win. Well, just come to the fight and you'll see. However, Jake Paul countered by confidently stating that he would knock out Tyson. He claimed that he's currently at the peak of his boxing career. In response, Tyson humorously pointed out his own weight, questioning how he could possibly be in his prime. 27-year-old who is in his prime. What do you say to that? I don't know if he's in his prime. He's fat. He should be lean and mean. He's fat and funky. According to Mike, he is confident that he will win. Despite being 57 years old, he cannot imagine being knocked out by Jake Paul, who hasn't been able to knock out Nate Diaz or Tommy Fury. He's not going to win. Look, he can't even knock out Nick Diaz. Nick Diaz is 40 pounds. How is he going to knock me out? He didn't knock out, never knocked out a real man. Come on. Despite the back and forth banter, Jake Paul remained adamant, promising to put Tyson to sleep in their upcoming fight on July 20th. Yet, Tyson is unfazed and ready to step into the ring. What I promise to the people is on July 20th, Mike will be put to sleep, and I will go down as the man who put Tyson to sleep for the last time. On another note, there's another big fight between undisputed female fighter Katie Taylor and Amanda Serrano. This is their second bout, happening after the main event showdown between Mike Tyson and Jake Paul. So, the fight airing on Netflix promises to be quite exciting. While fans have plenty of questions for the fighters, Mike Tyson remains focused on his upcoming match and can't say much else about it. Mike Tyson had some positive words for Jake Paul, acknowledging his improvement in boxing. However, Tyson humorously commented on Paul's weight gain. During a fan interaction, Tyson was asked which round he planned to knock down Jake Paul. Without hesitation, Tyson confidently stated that he would knock out Paul with his first punch. I think everybody wants to know what round you're going to knock out Jake Paul in. As soon as he get hit, the first punch. We all know Mike Tyson as the most brutal and legendary boxer of his time. Many famous fighters admire him and consider him an inspiration, including Jake Paul. For Paul, it's a great honor to fight the legendary Mike Tyson. My question's for Jake. When in your career are you going to actually fight a contender in your weight class and not do gimmick fights? I think he just called Mike Tyson a gimmick. Why did you just call me again? I didn't call you anything. Why did you call me? I didn't call you anything. 